Hello my dear students, this is Akash SD and welcome to the SD Physics classes. Hope so you all are doing really great. So students, in this video we are going to solve the question from the chapter Waves 11th and this question in a J2025 exam came from the, you can see the topic, from the organ pipes, closed organ pipe, open organ pipe and all that, okay? And this question is important for the NEET exam also. Concept is always important. I always take the questions of J that is important for the NEET because most of the time my focus is which exam? NEET exam. Okay, students, so let's start the video. Okay, so see the question is a closed organ and an open organ tube are filled by two different gases having same bulk modulus. Okay, but different densities row 1 and row 2 respectively that means closed organ pipe row 1 open organ pipe row 2 after that let's see the frequency of ninth harmonic of closed tube is identical with the fourth harmonic of open tube identical means what is there they are in a resonance very simple okay now see if the length of closed organ tube is 10 centimeter and density ratio of gases is how much given here 1 is to 16 then the length of open tube how much the question is looking somewhat very big but if you understood the basics and you note down all the given data this question can become very easy also now so let's see the question and let's decode the question here okay so what is there two different gases are there and same bulk modulus is there so you know very well here students see say different gases are there so for the different gases what is given the density ratio is how much given here 1 is to 16 because gases are different here okay after that second thing you can see very well what is constant uh, bulk modulus is constant so we can tell here this b is constant okay after that next one is friends we can see next one let's see here uh, the frequency of ninth harmonic of closed organ pipe is identical with the fourth harmonic of open pipe so see here please here ninth f ninth closed organ pipe is equal to f fourth open organ pipe this is also given okay now the length of closed tube how much given here the 10 centimeter so i have taken length of closed tube how much here 10 centimeter okay and what they are asking students here they are asking length of which tube they are asking length of the open tube now so this is the scenario of the question okay so students here remember that one thing here uh, if i draw here the pipes like this let's check here the pipes are there okay this is which pipe? This is the closed pipe. This there, the closed pipe. I will just draw for the first harmonic only. So here, this like this, like this used to form here. Okay, like this used to form. So here, what will happen? That here, students, in this situation, what is there? The density is the row one. Now, some gases are different, different. So density, how much here? Row one. So if the density is row one, here the speed of the sound in a gas, how much here? V one here. Okay. Similarly, after that, if I take here which pipe? Let's take. I have taken here the open pipe open pipe now in open pipe what will happen like this kind of situation will happen okay this kind of situation so here what is there let's take for example here students the density of the gas how much is rho 2 then what will happen is speed of the sound in the tube how much v2 now we are just trying to understand somewhat basics okay so now students here what is happening that here what is v what is v v is the speed of sound in the gas okay so now let's see here all these things basics we understood here so students you know very well as if I talk for the closed organ pipe, which pipe a closed organ pipe for closed organ pipe, the frequency is given by C N into V by how much is given here 2 LC. Okay, and the students here remember that here this closed organ pipe will always make which kind of harmonics odd harmonics like N equal to 1, 3, 5, 7, dot, dot, dot. Okay. Similarly, students, if I talk for the open organ pipe, open organ pipe, open organ pipe, what will happen right here? This will be given here n into v by 2l naught here. Okay. And one thing I will just uh, clarify this. See, this is not 2 actually. This is a 4 here. Okay. This is 4. Now, huh. now after that, what will happen? This will make even and odd harmonic box, both. Which one? Open organ pipe. So here we can write here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 like that. It will continue here. And what is V? V is the speed of sound in the pipe here. Okay. So remember that here, this V is given by square root of B by rho. Now B gas. B gas by rho. And maybe you have studied about water. You have studied about the Laplace correction also. And according to Laplace correction, when the sound is traveling in a gas, this is which process? This is the 
adiabatic process. Okay, that is a different game and all. Okay, but I have just told you here gamma p by rho. So students here, uh, if I talk about this one here, now if I talk about this here, this one we are going to use it. Okay, now students we will come to the question. No? We will come to the question. So see, according to question, what they told students according to question, this thing. Ninth harmonic of closed organ pipe is equal to fourth harmonic of open tube here. Okay, so see. Ninth harmonic of closed organ pipe is equal to fourth harmonic of open organ pipe. Okay, now let's see here. Students, closed organ pipe is here. Which one? Ninth, as I have told you very well, all the which kind of harmonics? Odd harmonics. So nine into speed of the sound is same as a vendor. See here. Here V1, here V2. Okay, so see here. This here I will write here. Nine V1 by four LC. Correct? Ninth harmonic closed organ pipe is equal to here which one fourth one so four is speed how much v2 by what is given here 2 l naught is it this is our scenario after the instruments we can uh, just cancel some of the things this is it will become here 2 2 yeah 4 okay so students here what we have to calculate we have to calculate the length of open organ pipe so if you would write here l naught l naught what we can write students uh, you can see very well v2 by v1 no? as i can see here v2 by v1 and this 4 into 2, 8 by 9 here. Yeah, so students, we can write here this L naught is equal to this one and uh, let's take here by LC. No? You can see very well L naught by LC, this is here. Now students, you can see very well in the question, they have given bulk modulus is constant. That means what is there? This V is inversely proportional to square root of it. What is this? Inversely proportional. Okay. So students, here what we can do here, here what we can do, uh, you can see very well here students we can do you see L naught by LC is equal to uh, all these things you can see very well 8 by 9 into square root of V2 by V1 will become what here it will become your inversely proportional so the 1 by root 2 here okay now next one see L naught by LC is equal to 8 by 9 see here please the 1 by root 2 how much given in a question the 1 by root 2 how much given students here 1 is to 16 no? just uh, See here, very well, 1 is to, uh, 16, no? the 1 by the 2 is given here, 1 is to 16 here. Okay, so see here, please, this one I have given here, 1 by 16, is it? So students, this will become here, see, 8 by 9 into, what will become here? 1 by 4, again you cancel out all these things and all, is it? So see here, 4 to the 8, no? That means if I write here, this L naught will come what here? It will come here, 2 by 9 into LC. LC value how much? Now even I remember 10 centimeters. So students you can see 2 by 9 into 10 centimeters. How much coming here? 20 by 9 centimeters. This is the answer. So if you will see here which option is coming here? The correct answer is here. Option B is the answer. So I hope so students the this question is very clear to you. Okay. So students keep studying, keep growing and keep on preparing for the NEET exam and the J-Mains exam. Take care.